Hey guys, this is going to be a quick video for my fellow second generation Honda Ridgeline owners. Uh, this is just going to be a quick walkthrough of how to remove the paneling from the bed of the truck. So here I just used the flathead screwdriver to remove the cap and there's just this one Phillips head screw that keeps the top panels in place. So after taking the screw out, slide the top panel towards the rear and it should pop right out. Um, you'll notice these white plugs, they're there to help align the panel once you place them back on after you're finished. So be mindful that these might pop out um, and just place them back in. Next, um, there's two different types of screws for the side panels. You'll need two different Torx bits to remove these screws. You'll need a T50 for the tie down hooks and you'll need T30 for the rest of the panel screws. And as you can see, it's a little challenging holding the phone and unscrewing these with just one hand. But I'm removing these panels because I wanted to install a rear view camera. Um, the dashboard camera that I bought came with a uh, rear view camera, so it records the front and the back at the same time. Typically, you'd mount this inside of the car, but I plan to be getting a, a shell put on the back, so um, I needed another solution to uh, mount this camera. The reason I'm taking these panels off is so I can hide the wiring of this camera. But I thought I'd record the process in case anybody else wanted to do something similar or was just curious to see what's inside. Once I reached this end, I noticed this last black plug here that's kind of holding these two pieces together. Um, so go ahead and use a flathead screwdriver there and just pop it right out. So once all the screws are removed, the panel should just come right off, but be careful not to pull it off too quickly because the wires for the side cargo light are pretty short, but there is a connector that I'll show you right here when it just pops right out. And that's the only wire connected to the panel itself. And then it just comes right out like that. Anyways, that's pretty much it. Um, to put everything back together, you just follow these steps in reverse and don't forget to reconnect that side cargo light. But yeah, let me know if there's anything in particular you want to see with the new 2017 Honda Ridgeline. Um, I'm really loving this new truck. Um, it's been perfect for everything I need it for. So expect more videos about it in the future. See you guys next time.